December 18, 2025. In a display of strategic ingenuity and industrial resilience, Russia is intelligently applying cutting-edge technologies developed for the revolutionary T-14 Armada main battle tank to enhance its extensive fleet of T-90M and T-72 tanks. This approach maximizes the strengths of the Armada program while rapidly bolstering the combat effectiveness of thousands of existing vehicles, solidifying Russia's armored dominance in contemporary warfare. The T-14 Armada represents the zenith of Russian tank design a true fourth-generation platform that redefines modern armored warfare through innovative engineering focused on crew protection, superior firepower, and advanced digital integration. Central to the Armada's groundbreaking design is its unmanned turret, which houses the main armament remotely while encapsulating the three-man crew in a heavily fortified capsule within the hull. This configuration dramatically enhances survivability, isolating operators from direct threats, and allowing sustained operations even under heavy bombardment. The low-profile turret reduces radar and visual signatures, complicating enemy detection and targeting. The primary weapon is the powerful 125mm 2A-82-1M smoothbore gun, offering superior muzzle velocity, accuracy and penetration capabilities compared to previous generations. Capable of firing advanced armor-piercing fin-stabilized discarding sabot, APFSDS rounds like the Vacuum 1, as well as guided missiles, it ensures devastating lethality at long ranges. An automatic loader enables high rates of fire, maintaining pressure on adversaries. Protection is elevated by the Afghanid Active Protection System, APS, a sophisticated hard-kill suite that detects and intercepts incoming projectiles, including anti-tank guided missiles, ATGMs, RPGs, and even high-velocity kinetic rounds. Augmented by soft-kill measures such as multispectral smoke screens and electronic jammers, Afghanit provides comprehensive layered defense against top attack threats and drones. The Armada's composite and reactive armor, including advanced Malakit ERA, further bolsters resistance to modern threats. All-around sensors, including panoramic thermal imagers and radar, deliver unparalleled 360-degree situational awareness, integrated into a digital battlefield network for seamless coordination with supporting units. Mobility excels with a 1,500 horsepower A, 85.3A diesel engine, advanced hydrostatic transmission, and active suspension, achieving road speeds up to 90 km per hour and exceptional off-road performance, outpacing many Western counterparts. By selectively transferring these Armada-derived technologies, such as the 2A82-1M gun, Kalina fire control system, enhanced optics, and protection elements, Russia is upgrading its T-90M ProRiv tanks to unprecedented levels. The T-90M gains improved penetration, precision targeting, and defensive capabilities, transforming it into a highly lethal platform. Modernized T-72 variants, including the T-72B-3M, benefit from similar infusions. Upgraded armor packages, digital electronics, and sensor suites inspired by Armada research. These enhancements improve survivability against evolving threats while retaining the T-72's proven reliability and ease of production.
This pragmatic strategy allows Russia to field a massive, technologically superior armored force without awaiting full T-14 deployment. It exemplifies efficient resource allocation, turning R&D investments into immediate battlefield advantages and maintaining numerical superiority alongside qualitative edges. Russia's defense industry continues to innovate amid challenges, demonstrating adaptability and commitment to military excellence. Infusing Armada technologies into the T-90M and T-72 fleet ensures Russian forces remain formidable, deterring potential aggressors and safeguarding national security with cutting-edge prowess. As armored warfare evolves, this hybrid approach positions Russia at the forefront, ready to meet future threats with confidence and overwhelming strength. As of December 2025, the T-14 Armada has not seen meaningful or sustained combat deployment in the Ukraine war. Early 2023 Russian state media reports claimed limited use for indirect fire support or brief experimental frontline testing, with tanks reportedly fitted with extra protection and later withdrawn for finalization. These claims remain unverified independently, and no confirmed photos or evidence of T-14s in active combat, e.g., destroyed, captured, or engaged directly, have emerged. Ukrainian intelligence officials stated in 2023 that they had not observed any T-14 in action.